Leadership advice is funny. I think the worst leadership advice I ever received was from an officer senior to me, just as I was assuming battalion command in the 82nd Airborne Division of 600 paratroopers. And he got me in a room with another officer and he said, what you do west of Gruber Road, and that meant out in the training areas where actually do your business, isn't important. It's what you do in garrison. It's how the organization looks. It's what the commanding general thinks of you that matters, how you brief. And it was so completely off what I thought at the time and what I've come to believe even more strongly about what a military leader in that case should be. I think the best leadership advice I ever got was from a guy junior to me, a sergeant major that was very close to me. And what he basically said, and I won't try to quote it, but he goes, let the boys get it done. There are times when you wanna be in charge, you wanna prescribe exactly what happens. He says, if you tell them what has to happen and let the boys do it, they'll get it done. And I don't know how many times that plays back in my mind in years, even when you're a little worried about it, what if it goes wrong? I've, I've found that that is invariably the best course of action.